I had a big fear of Evan passing and what that would look like and where I would be. So I held him all the time. And I was fearful of if I didn't get all the holds in, I wouldn't be able to, I, I would miss out. Evan is three years old right now. He was diagnosed at six months, or the day before he was six months. He has minkies, which is a copper deficiency. Um, it's a genetic disorder that's terminal. Um, his body does not absorb copper like everybody else's does, which causes his brain not to develop correctly. We got nursing at home, which helped me um, just kind of let go um i needed a lot of control and i realized quit doing that he's grinding his teeth <laughs> um that i just needed to let somebody else do it and that it was okay and then it took me a while i remember the first time i left the house was like i'd run to target and come back and then i would run to sam's which is right next door to target and then come all the way back and then i would run somewhere else and come back and my nurse is like why don't you just stay out i'm like yeah i just I needed that. I needed it to feel, I trusted her, but I needed needed the control of still being mom. And then I got over that Evan will pass whenever he passes and it doesn't matter what I'm doing. And whether I'm home, which I hope I am, I mean, I would be heartbroken if he had to go through that by himself. Just for you guys. When bad things happen, they're bad. And it's, overwhelming it and it's paralyzing if you let it fear is paralyzing all I've ever wanted to be was a mom and I have the best kid he just has a really short time period 